Chetan went back upstairs, but he could not sleep. His head was too full of thoughts. He was thinking, I would quite like to stay up late watching television and eating cocoa puffs. Why is it always me who has to clean up the rubbish? I hate broccoli. Most of all, he was thinking, what is so good about being a goodie? You were probably thinking this a long time ago. The, the goodie is very much about labels and the dangers of being compartmentalized um, and boxed in. I, I wonder if you ever felt the same about your art style. Do you feel like people associate you with a particular style? I think it's inevitable that you get associated with your best known work and for me perhaps that's Charlie and Lola. But in fact that was just an art style that was created for that particular story series. So the drawing style, the collage style and even the materials I use will differ from book to book. There's a sort of preciseness to the artwork because this is a child living a rather rigid life. I've drawn him doing all these various chores and the pictures are set in sort of boxes and the typography it sets it's set very straight and it and the text does not interact with the pictures in a playful way. And the backgrounds for the most part are all monochrome to suggest a certain joylessness and it's only as the children break out of these rather rigid roles they're in that all the colour comes in and it becomes very very vibrant and beautiful. How challenging is it to suggest emotions through, through drawing would you say? It depends which emotion you're drawing. Drawing anger can be much easier to show than, than perhaps compassion and I want, there was one picture where I wanted to show this boy with a sort of look of bewildered disappointment on his face and so I worked quite hard to, to try and convey that and I often think back to my own childhood to sort of remember how did something feel and how might I have looked at that age feeling that emotion. And this is what's so powerful about your stories, I think, is that often there is aspects of your own childhood in there. The not liking peas, I think, is possibly something to do with you not liking peas. I love peas, I hated mushrooms. So they gave the broccoli to the rabbit instead, and the rabbit seemed to smile because it was very fond of broccoli. Rabbit smile. <laughs>